lifestyle. And welcome back to Talk of Alabama. It's now time to chat about five free apps that can help you save big in 2016. Digital lifestyle expert Kelly Wonderland is here with all of the details and welcome to you. Thank you so much for having me. And I just want to say she's had a rough morning already. They lost her luggage at the airport, so she had to go to the store and get new clothes, new makeup, new hair dryer, everything. So we're excited that you even had enough energy to get here this morning. Thank you so much for having <laughs> me. It's it's definitely been an adventure. It always is. Let's uh, let's just start with Slice. Is that the first app we're going to talk about? That is. And so, if you're doing a lot of online shopping, Slice is okay. an app that's going to keep track of your tracking numbers. It also lets you know if a product's been recalled or if a product's gone on sale and then you can get a refund. Oh, that's nice. When you say tracking numbers cuz sometimes if you're shopping a lot and they, you know, if you don't have a printer at home right. and this will keep everything in one place for you. Yeah, that way you're not going to like a UPS page or a FedEx page and hitting that refresh button. Okay, that's good to know. And it's just Slice? Just Slice. That's yeah. it? Yep. Okay, Slice. Okay, that's the first one. So that certainly could save you time and energy. Hopper is another one. Yes, and so Hopper is an app that tells you when to buy plane tickets. It lets you know if you should purchase your ticket now or wait because a better price is around the corner. So say you wanted to select February 13th through the 16th. Okay. It'll say, don't book now because in about two weeks, the price will drop by $80. Now, or, how does it know that? I have no idea. It searches through Delta, American Airlines, everything. And it's just, you know, someone's like, it can see the future. I guess it can. I was going to say, well, that's good, especially these days with so many people traveling. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so that's Hopper. H-O-P-P-E-R. -P -P -E yes. Okay, that's the second one. Pocket is another one. Yes, so there's a lot of great content online, and of course sometimes you don't have time to read everything because you're busy, you're doing other things, taking care of your kids, taking care of your husband. So essentially you can store an article from Yahoo, Mashable, Engadget in your pocket and come back to it later. You can also view oh, that I same article that. when you're not hooked up to Wi-Fi. So that's oh, really neat. Oh, that is nice. I like yeah. that. Because I a lot of times will start reading an article online and then one of my children do something, you know, like break a window or I don't know, something happens and I'm like, what? And I put it down and I have in good intentions to finish it and then I never do and then I'll find myself days later thinking, I wonder what that rest of that article is and then I can't find it again. Exactly. And then you can never find it and so it goes into a lost world of okay. <laughs> unsaved pages. Pocket. P-O-C-K-E-T. That's the other one. Run P. What is that? Run P tells you the best time to leave the movie theater to go to the restroom. Oh, the one Ebony and I were talking about. Okay, so how does that work? So it tells you like at one hour and 38 minutes, go to the restroom. It tells you exactly how many minutes you have to be gone and it tells you everything that you're going to miss. Really? Yes. So it is, is it targeting the boring part of the movie? Is that the time to go? <laughs> That's exactly what someone else asked me. You know, I have not yet used it, but my sister used it. I know some other people who have used it, and they said that, you know, it works. Okay, as long as you can hold it that long. That's exactly. a good app for you. Run P. Okay, Wish is another one. So Wish is something that I recently came across, and it's basically the hottest and latest trends at a discounted price. So I've seen shirts on there for as little as a dollar, and they're really cute clothes. So you can pay by PayPal or credit card, and everything's just delivered right to your home. Really? Yeah. And how's the shipping on there? Uh, I believe it's pretty inexpensive. Okay, I got yeah. you. Because I'm thinking, you don't want to pay $6 for shipping for a $1 shirt. I know I did order a pair of earrings for my first purchase. It was yes. only a dollar, and they were crystal earrings, and the shipping was free. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I need to get all these apps, and, and obviously our segments, you know, we post online. So if you missed any of these and you need to reiterate, you can go to our website this afternoon, and you can certainly get them there. You can also go to Kelly's website, which is kellywonderland.com, and she's going to have a full list of all these free apps to save you money, time, and make your life, you know, more convenient in 2016. Well, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for having me. And I hope you find your luggage. Thank you. I hope so, too. <laughs> Otherwise, it may end up, you know, in the land of lost luggage. And if that's the case, I'll be emailing you asking for you to go get it, please. <laughs> okay, no problem. I'm sure there's an app for that, too. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure. Thank you. Stay tuned. We're back in the kitchen with Trey.